guys in today's devrian of uh, devrian video in the uh, pattern video i am telling you about the string concatenation okay what is string concatenation we are telling you about that so get ready for that and this very small video okay so now uh, please like this video share your friends and subscribe to my channel and do not forget to all the notification bell also and i appreciate your support bro and if you genuinely appreciate my work so please let your friends know about this course too and if you haven't checked my whole playlist yes so move on to the go davian.com my youtube channel so you can easily access it and bookmark it also so now i do not take your long time so let move to the computer screen and let's learn about string concatenation and our string series as uh, series is coming like that like in the previous video i told you about the modify string uh, from the previous video i told you about the slashing strings so our string series has been starting uh, again here uh it is our third video of the strings okay so now i do not take a long time so let's move to the computer screen and let's do a coding we loving so guys uh in today's python video i am telling about the string concatenation so let's start and let's learn about that what are a uh, python in the python what are co string concatenation so let's start string concatenation to concatenate or combine two strings you can use the plus operator if you or if you combine two strings you can use the plus operator like that there are one string is about like this one string i have made it this this one generally i am making this two string i have made it so i have been combine these strings so how you can combine these strings you can use a plus operator how you can write here like that okay so then it has been combined or or merge here you can see this type of a plus operator has been used okay it, it is used or combined uh, it is to concatenate or combine two strings you can use the plus operator for example if you merge the variable a variable where a variable with variable b into variable c so you can do it like that so when i go on my visual studio code and if i i go on file and make one file by the name of like uh, string series dot py when i make this file and i am making this file on the documents when i make this file and create file so this file has been made it by the name of string series.py here you can see it when i paste this code like here so what you can do like in the first line i define a uh, variable a and in the variable a i write like uh, in the uh, variable i i define a string hello world and in the variable b i define a string world okay and in the number th third line i wrote here the c variable and in the c variable i write here equals to and i say in the third line i say to a c variable please uh, merge the a variable plus to a b variable so then it has been merged the a variable with b variable because of i write here plus operator that's why if i run it should give me hello uh, when i save it and run it should give me hello world like that here you can see it why it is giving me hello world in the like that because in the third line i say to the my c variable a plus b and why it is printing c it is not printing a and b because in the fourth line i write like here print c if i write like here print a should give me only hello oh sorry i write it in the capital if i write here a should give me hello only if i write here c and save it and it should give me hello world like that here you can see it like that you can very do very easily as yes. and now if i wrote here uh, c and if i go here and if i write here a plus b and if i write here a plus b and save it and then it should give me hello world like that but if you want a space in here so you can and do like that then save it and then it so sorry do like that should give me a space here do not give a space here so you can see it hello world is give you the space you can do it very easily as yes. and now to add a space between them add a double if you add a space between them there is one one more uh, way to add a space between them you can write here plus and then you can write here double comma then here you can write like plus then same way and then it should give me hello world like that here if you do not write here space so sorry here when i save it and run it so 
B is not definite. Okay, B is not defined. It's saying like B is not defined. Now here you can see it. It gives you the output hello world and it will give you the space. Like you can do, oh, uh, you can give the space, uh, this type of uh, space like that also. Here you can see it. You can do it very easily, yes. Now let's come here and uh, like and do it. And if you change here like hello world and if you write like here hello Ryan and, and if I write here A plus a plus B and then it give you the hello Ryan here you can see like that like that you can very easily as do why it give you the hello Ryan because I write a plus operator plus operator is used to used to to combine to combine or add a two strings if I write here 15 and 10 so it give me a 1510 why it is not giving me 15 and 10 uh, because uh, Python has been used like a mathematical operator also like 15 plus 10 is equals to 1510 let me show you who 15 sorry let me go on the calculator let me show you 15 plus 10 sorry 25 okay why are you giving me that 5 1510 so okay I write like here multiply then run it so it give me error plus save it and it it should give me 25 now why because in the here i do not write like double commas if you write double commas so the python will understand this is a string but if you do not write the uh, double commas so the python will be understand oh this is not a string this is a one str okay okay that you can do it very easily it's like 25 is giving like the python will be also used like a uh, also use like a mathematical operator if I write like multiply sign and run it so uh, 15 multiply by 10 equals to 150 like it is giving like that if I write here minus so it will give me 15 minus 10 equals to 5 uh, here you can see it if I write here divide it so it give me like uh, uh, 1.5 why it is giving me in the decimal in the decimal they give me the output why because uh, in the a 50, first of all we write like 15 in the b I write like 10 in the C, I write like A divided by B, so it give me 1.5. Like that, you can do it very easily, yes. So here you can see it. In today's video, I told you about the Python string concatenation. You must know these things about the Python string concatenation. And you must know these things. This is a small video, I know. Because, because there are very some very few things to, uh, to tell you about it, okay. So that's why it is very small video. So from the next video, the next video is come up to... 10 minutes okay that video is very small so sorry for that but now here you can see it i told you about the string concatenation so i appreciate your support bro and if you generally appreciate my work so please let your friends know about this course too and if you haven't checked my whole playlist yet so moving on to the e debrian.com or my youtube channel so you can easily access it and bookmark it also and please tell me if our the with the python we may we start up one more series so please tell me in the comment section below and what you will be learning in the channel so please tell me about that and please tell me in the comment how is my performance is going and how is my all thing is going in my cha in the my channel please tell me and play uh, so now i made the next lesson next very amazing class and please do my 5000 subscribers please okay so request okay so now for today good bye